the Labor Party's position on the industrial relations laws is extremely important because Labor is the alternative government of this country. Labor has made some commitments which are very important for all working families. A clear choice is emerging between Labor and the government on industrial relations. And to hear more about that, we invited to speak to you today the leader of the Labor Party, Mr Kim Beasley. Please make him welcome. Friends, today I'm here to tell you we are going to rip up these laws. I want to thank each and every one of you, the hundreds of thousands of working families across the country who have been willing to stand up and fight for good Aussie values at work. And I want to thank too the ACT and your unions who have been with you every step of the way. We are inspired by your passion, by your commitment, by your patriotism. You have made this campaign. You have been magnificent. And you and the Labor Party stand as one. We believe in fairness, that everybody should be treated decently and with respect that it's wrong to sack someone unfairly or for no reason, wrong to force workers to sign individual contracts that cut their pay, wrong to destroy the award safety net and independent umpire. That is why we will rip these laws up, because John Howard wants you working harder, longer and for less. Our campaign is for the future of working families. Now that the, uh, the High Court has said it cannot stop John Howard's IR laws, the issues are very clear. The only way to get rid of these extreme laws is to throw Howard out. Only way. And it's something all of you can do. And then. When we rip up John Howard's laws, we will put in their place a balanced and fair system. We will abolish AWA individual contracts. No one will be forced to sign a contract that disadvantages them in order to get a job and we will have a decent safety net of pay and conditions. We will reward effort with overtime and penalty rates. Our system will have at its very core collective bargaining. If a majority of workers want a collective agreement, why shouldn't they have it? And people will be free to join and be represented by a union. No ifs or buts about it. The more people I meet, who have been dealt with unfairly by these laws, the more determined we are to make sure they are overthrown. And I see in you a fighting spirit that tells me you are not prepared to accept this mistreatment. This is the fight of our lives. There is so much at stake and that's why this campaign is so vital. Now, to those of you who may not have supported Labor in the past, I sincerely ask for your support this time. This time and on this issue, we all must stand together. Let's build that modern, fair and flexible IR system Australians deserve. Let's make Australia the nation of a fair go again. Yeah.